Our next international award winners are Dr. Demis Sasabis and Dr. John Jumper. Together, they are being awarded for developing AlphaFold, which has been heralded as an AI-based solution to the 50-year grand challenge of protein structure prediction and has culminated in the release of the most accurate and complete picture of the structure of the human proteome with enormous potential to accelerate biological and medical research. First up is Dr. John Jumper. He is the AlphaFold lead and senior staff research scientist at Google DeepMind. Dr. Jumper has chosen Paul Dukas, the sorcerer's apprentice for his music. I would now ask Dr. Jumper to come to the stage. <laughs> How extraordinarily exciting. I really want to thank the Gardner Foundation and the Gardner uh, jury. This is an extraordinary award. And it really represents um, not just Demis and my work, but the work of an entire uh, team at DeepMind. Uh, extraordinary team that really started, I think, as a uh, group of uh, physicists and computer scientists with one kind of recently converted biologist in the mix, and, uh, and became, by the end, a team of structural biologists. And I think we couldn't have done it without people who um, loved and cared deeply about this problem and really dedicated themselves to solving it. And the work is so important. It is so very important that we develop computational biology, that we're able to use AI to understand the world the world of biology is so big and so important and so important to our health that we need tools to meet this complexity. We need to be able to solve these problems because at the end of it, our understanding of biology means that people will be healthy who would otherwise be sick, that lives can be saved and lives can be better. And I can't think of anything more gratifying than the work that uh, has been done using uh, the tools of AlphaFold in so many creative ways. And really, these applications, all the ways in which, you know, even coming to the Gardner events and having incredible scientists coming up and having ideas about how they might use structure prediction to aid their own work, that's the best part. My favorite thing is to find a new paper in nature and science, a new discovery uh, that was made using our tools and was made without us, that it shows the power of computation to build new platforms on which great scientists can stand. And uh, ultimately, I think it's, it's the most important thing. Um, I chose the, the Sorcerer's Apprentice and really thinking about the version from Fantasia with Mickey. And uh, <laughs> because it's such, uh, I think, a wonderful parable. He finally discovers the ability to automate the hard parts of his job, you know, that he, he fills the buckets with water and soon they are overflowing. Now it doesn't go so well at the end and he has to be rescued. <laughs> but we're, we have an abundance, we have new tools, we have 200 million predicted structures. We should do incredible things with this overflowing amount of knowledge. And I see every evidence, and I see it in journals every day, that we're doing so. And so I think it's the most extraordinary thing. And I think that it will make biology go faster. And that will, the world will care. Thank you very much.